Bush is like Rora said, are what makes the game so special. She's been in the stable now for three and a half years and every day um, she puts a smile on our face. She goes to a racetrack, tries so hard and it means so much to myself, the staff, the owners to have a horse like that. This is your chance to own a horse for the day, Royal Descent. She's possibly the best mare in Australia. The big one is the Doncaster. It's a $3 million race. The first prize is $1.6 million. So I'm relinquishing 10% of that for some lucky person. And if she wins, they will get $160,000 for the day. Royal Descent is now peeling wide and is starting to run. She was ready to peak on the day and she had quite a bit of weight for a mare to carry. So expectations weren't too high, but we knew we had a good horse and uh, she looked the winner. Nashra Willer even said after the race, he said, I had the race won. I was beaten by a freak performance, which was Sacred Falls, the stable mate on the day. Sacred Falls does it. Back to back for Sacred Falls, beat Royal Descent and Weary. She's got the same weight this year as she had last year. Um, she's just that little bit older and a little bit stronger. And I think she's ready for another big run. The adrenaline you get from racing a horse is second to none. Doesn't matter what age you are, what nationality, what religion you are, we all get on the racetrack, we're all the same, and we have a great time. And she's done it for her. If she wins the Doncaster, you won't be as excited as me, but you might be. The emotion that goes through you, you'll feel like maybe you've never felt before. And Royal Descent, this is a massacre. This is your chance, if you like, to experience that emotion. And that emotion is something that might only come to you once in your entire life. Some people never, never experience that emotion. So let's hope she wins the Doncaster in 2015.